Okay, so when you're shopping for groceries, seeing a few shopping carts here and there is to be expected. I'll be honest, this is the first time I've seen it, it's blowing me away. But <laughs> what if you saw someone driving it on the freeway? Photojournalist Derek Moreno got a chance to meet the man behind the viral larger than life basket on wheels. <laughs> First time I drove it was around the neighborhood. I tried all the lights, checked all the lights, checked the brakes, make sure everything was good and safe. It started off as a project for the uh, Christmas toy drives. I wanted to do something. I had just finished a radio flyer wagon for the Shriners, and I didn't have nothing else for this Christmas season this past year. So I said, I need to do something different. And that's when we just started looking around and we saw a shopping cart and said, how about that? And said, why not? And one guy said, you can't do it. And I said, let's see. So two months later, but it took a whole bunch of guys, not just me. It was several companies that came into the picture, a whole bunch of individuals that wanted to be part of the, the project. All the guys that came into the picture were from the heart, not from the pocket. I didn't ask anybody for any kind of monies. I just needed material. And whatever they had, we made that part fit into the project. Only in Texas. <laughs> They're all always stopping, want to take pictures, ask questions as to why, and I just answer, why not? Why be the same? I don't follow other people. I do my own stuff. I'm not a social numbers person. I like to make things, weld, grind, those kind of things. After the show from Lowe's, we started driving towards Carfest, which was in San Antonio. In between Lowe's shirts and Carfest, San Antonio, and Joe Freeman Coliseum, that's when they filmed it. And it was all by accident. We didn't plan nothing. I didn't plan any of this. If you can dream it or think of it, do it. Don't get held back. Don't get. Don't let somebody else tell you you can't do it. Take the challenge. Step up to the plate and just do it. Oh Man, yeah. I'm telling you, oh, that's yeah. one of the coolest things I have seen. It is amazing and what a powerful message. I have to say, Derek, if you're watching this right now, this is one of my favorite stories you've ever done. Yeah, and the yeah. only problem is one of the wheels gets a little rickety, but where do you go? I'm just, I'm just. Where do you take it I'm though? Just, he need, does he need like oil changes? I, I need to know. I'm okay, just well, we did ask Jay if this was legal. He assured us that the giant cart has all that's needed to drive on the streets, including stickers, plates, lights, and yes, in case you're wondering as well, everything is up to date. That's just amazing. 